Once a change request has been approved, action groups are notified of tasks allocated to them. Note that tasks can be concurrent, meaning multiple tasks can be actioned at the same time. Or sequential, tasks cannot be started until the previous one is completed. To start work on a task, just double click on the first task to be implemented. Set the status to work in progress. Once the task is completed, set the status reason to close and select the status reason. The final step in closing a task is to click on the dates tab and add the actual start and end date that you implemented the task. Then click save. To navigate back to the change request, click the change request number in the breadcrumb car. Groovy, huh? Here's a tip. Sequential tasks cannot be closed unless preceding tasks have been set to a status completed. Once all tasks have been closed and saved, the change request is automatically set to completed. The change request is still an implement stage. It has a status of completed and the status reason of final review required. Once the last task is set to closed, the requester will receive a notification that the change request needs to be set to final review complete. Change management then review the and close all change requests. If, however, the change request is not manually closed, it will auto-close after nine days, depending on the status being set to completed and the status reason being set to final review complete.